Hello everyone, welcome to the channel. So in this video, I'm gonna show you how to download the Tidal uh, data for any location in the world. So in the search bar, type as WX Tide uh, 32. So now here you can able to visualize I have entered as WX Tide 32. So now I'm gonna click enter to search. So now uh, click the first result WX Tide 32 dot uh, COM. I'm gonna click this. So this is the interface of uh, WX Tide 32, uh, free window tide and uh, current prediction program. So it predicts the tides from 1970 uh, to uh, 2027 and more than 9,500 stations worldwide uh, with uh, 160 in England, uh, Ireland and Scotland and more than, uh, more than uh, 300 tidal uh, current stations and all in North America. So the text output will be a daily uh, tide list and monthly calendar an incremental tide so now to download this particular uh, data set uh, we have to navigate uh, down here so we're gonna click this option here uh, manual install for any version so uh, download and install uh, download the latest manual install version wx tide 47 meter dot zip and now to download uh, we're gonna click this uh, wx tide 47 meter dot zip so once you did that and uh, we are going to navigate to the folder location where you could like to save this file here. So I have navigated to the folder location. So I am going to click save. So now here it has downloaded the file wx tide 47 meter dot zip. So this is my folder location uh, where I have saved my file. I am going to right click on this uh, zip file and click this option called extract here. So it is going to extract all the files in this folder. And now uh, we're gonna run this uh, particular tool, uh, this particular tool here. So we're gonna right click on this WX Tide 32, and we're gonna click this option called Run as Administrator. We're gonna click Yes. So uh, window pops up here. You can able to see. Let me arrange this. So this is a software interface uh, where uh, we can able to download our uh, Tide data. And now we're gonna navigate to this option called file and uh, go to this option called location so it's gonna pop uh, pop up a new window let me arrange this and now uh, select a location where you would like to uh, download your title data so you're gonna click here so now you can able to visualize the different station that is available in this uh, part of the study area so all the stations being indicated in this window here you can able to see the different stations name has been indicated here so here you can able to observe the different data set that is available so i could like to download the data from this particular station called midras india so i'm going to click this so and now i'm going to click ok So now uh, navigate to this option in the files and uh, click this option called overview and uh, let me uh, zoom this and uh, you can see the overview of this uh, particular title data from uh, here and uh, you can also select the date range from, from this particular uh, software. So you're going to click this file here and we're going to click this option called daily tide and we have this new, new window. So now here uh, we have this window saying the text tide output type. So we're going to select as a daily tide and after that we have this option uh, called uh, length. So you can select the days uh, here. So you're going to select the number of days to be uh, around 15 days and the months uh, this you can select from 1 to 24. And after that we're going to select the start date. So you're going to click this option here. We're going to select the start date. So uh, let me select the start date to be around uh, May 1. So uh, once you have selected uh, your uh, days and uh, the start date, we're going to click this option called start. And uh, after that, we're going to uh, get the data from this particular uh, window here. So now we can able to see the data from this particular window here. So we get all the data here starting from May 1 to uh, May 15 here. So uh, you can able to see here May 1 to uh, May 15. 
we get the data so we have the different tides here high tides low so you can able to see that so this is an easiest way to download the tidal data for uh, any location in the world here so uh, we have uh, shown you that how to download the tidal data for uh, any location in the world using the particular uh, software called uh, WX Tide 32. So thanks for watching and uh, please subscribe to our channel and give us a like.